get this question a lot. Inheriting tenants in my rental property, what am I supposed to do? I'm Kim Meredith Hampton with Hampton & Hampton Management & Leasing, your Central Florida property management company. Regional, we're in Florida, serving east to west coast, Tampa, Orlando, and Melbourne. Inheriting tenants can be a good and a bad thing. When you're conducting your due diligence, ask for a copy of the rent roll, the leases, and of course, try to view the interior of the property. I know sometimes it's not possible. I've seen some existing owners of the property let the tenants go month to month because they knew they'd be selling the property and didn't want to burden the new owner with old leases and that rents and with the rents that are under market and the units needed extensive rehab. No way for you to make an intelligent decision on the purchase or your cash flow until you have seen or looked at a lot of these items. As far as the existing tenants go, if they are in a month to month, you have no obligation to keep them. Always a good idea to check your state's statutes on the rental landlord just to be sure every state is completely different. I could not say that enough. Every state is completely different. Most of the time, you can just give them a 30-day notice of non-renewal. If they don't vacate, then you would need to begin eviction proceedings. Or maybe you could try that cash for keys. As a side note, and something that usually gets overlooked, have the security deposits for the tenants in the closing documents. This way, if there's anything after the fact, it's in writing and it's documented. I'm Kim Meredith Hampton. Don't worry about inheriting tenants and the process. As long as you follow the laws in these states, you'll be fine. Thanks for listening. Bye.